Well, good morning. This morning, our scripture is found in Mark, chapter 12, verse 30, and it goes like this. And thou shalt love the Lord thy God with all thine heart, with all thy soul, and with all thy might, and with all thy strength. This is the first commandment. Do you truly, I mean truly, love the Lord with all your heart, soul, and mind? We're supposed to. That's what the scripture tells us. But, you know, many times we let life stand in the way. And, uh, you know, we have things that pop up, but we don't go to the Lord in prayer. No, we just take it out on our own. And uh, I don't know about you, but every time I do that, I get in trouble. I do. Because the next thing you know, we start stretching the truth here, there, and everywhere. Telling plain old blatant lies to others about whatever's going on. You know, and we fail. I did. And sometimes I still do. Fail to ask for forgiveness for my sin. And, uh, you know, folks, we're supposed to repent. You know, when you sin and you know that you've sinned, because the Spirit of God will speak to your heart, and he, you'll know that you've sinned. But what happens? We, uh, we just keep on keeping on. We just sort of plug our ears to the Spirit, if you will. And we dig this sin pit, and I mean we dig it deep. And the next thing you know, we're as lost as a goose in a hailstorm. That's right. Well, whenever we start living like that, without asking for forgiveness of sin, and we know we have sinned, because the Bible tells us that for all has sinned. And so that's human nature is to sin. And we have to ask for forgiveness. And uh, if not, we did get pit so deep we can't see the light. Yep. So what we have to do when we find ourselves in this situation, we need to repent. Now, Romans 6 and 23 tells us, For the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life through Jesus Christ our Lord. So quit digging that pit of sin. Ask for forgiveness. Begin reading the Word of God. Pray daily. I mean, not just when trouble comes up. I'm talking about pray constantly. We're supposed to be praying all the time. The Spirit will help you navigate through all of this stuff that comes our way if you just rely on Him. Well, I hope this encourages someone today. May God richly bless you. I love you, but better yet, Jesus loves you. Yep, He died on the cross for us. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye now.